Hey Leverage WP, let's talk about hosted email a little bit and I want to show you a service that's relatively new provided by Cloudflare for uh, utilizing custom email addresses at your domain name or your business domain name, your client's domain names uh, if you're a web designer without having to pay for hosted email. Now you can't use these two services at the same time and I'll show you why that is, but let's take a look and let me share my screen here. Right here, you're looking at my grid pane uh, hosting control panel. And if I look at something like leveragewp, leveragewp.com, um, uh, as far as this domain name here, now I've got the website hosted at a dedicated server at a particular IP address. And it's best that you don't use the same server for sending and receiving and storing email uh, that you deliver your website from. And that's a best practice uh, around WordPress around and around any web design platform. Um, and the reason is you don't want to have your, your email taking up storage and slowing down your server and worst case scenario, have your website go down just because your email box is full or there's an email routing issue. Another issue is that you want to preserve the reputation of your IP address and email has a risk of you know, succumbing to spam and things like that. And you can have your IP address blacklisted, which would then mean you would have to migrate your website to a different server to get, get a different IP address if your IP address ends up being blacklisted. By using a service to host email addresses, this is send and receive hosted email at a custom domain name, like the one I have, you know, greg at leveragewp.com. Um, then you need to host your email somewhere. Google Workspace is a good and popular example that costs about $6 per email address per month for 25 to 30 gigabytes of storage space. And that's a lot for an email box. I prefer to use Rackspace. Rackspace Office, it used to be called, but Rackspace hosted email costs $2.99 per month per email address. It comes with all this support and all, you know, 30 gigabytes now of, uh, of files. I think it's 25, 25 gigabytes of email storage, plenty for an email address. But most importantly, they protect the reputation of the IP addresses that they use to send and receive email. And so the deliverability is very high. It comes through very, very fast. And you connect it to your domain name uh, using DNS or the domain name system. Now, Cloudflare is an excellent DNS provider. I always recommend that you layer Cloudflare in between your domain name registration and your website and email services. And so with a free Cloudflare account set up for your domain name, you can see that if I look up Leverage WP here in my Cloudflare account, if I click the DNS uh, tab here on the left, you can see that I have a number of DNS records and some of them are labeled MX records. This stands for Mail Exchanger. And so you can see that I have two here, mx2.emailserver.com and then mx1.emailserver.com. These are the official DNS records required to connect email to Rackspace, Rackspace hosted email. And so my email is powered in the very best way for send and receive email, uh, the traditional email that you might have seen, what I call hosted email or normal or uh, you know common send and receive email. A person to a person for sending and receiving. And so what I wanted to show you here with Cloudflare is that Cloudflare has a, an email service that is relatively new that's not hosted email. It's free if you're using uh, Cloudflare as your DNS provider, which is also free. But you can't have hosted email and also use their email routing system. I'll show you here. If I click email under this leveragewp.com, it's telling me that if I want to use email routing, I would have to get rid of these conflicting DNS records right here that are email server and email server.com. This is what sends email traffic at this domain name, like my email address, greg at leveragewp.com, to the Rackspace email server to be processed. Now, if I get rid of these DNS records, my Rackspace email will stop working. But they recommend if I want to use Cloudflare for this email routing, 
I have to add their own DNS records right here. Now, I wouldn't want to do that because what that does is it uses this email routing. And you might think of email routing in Cloudflare as email forwarding. Uh, a lot of hosts like shared hosts, uh, for example, you know, Bluehost or, or SiteGround, they include email services as a part of their share, sh shared hosting service, which I do not recommend using at all. Uh, and so, uh, uh, you know, again, you want to separate your services for good redundancy and protection in case anything were to go wrong. You've got multiple points of failure, so everything doesn't get ruined all at once because of one problem. And so I don't want to use email routing for my Leverage WP domain name. Let's just look at another one of dom my domain names, and I'll show you how I set up an email routing system, otherwise known as email forwarding or even an email alias for a particular domain name. And so I'm going to come over here and look at the, the new kind of play domain that I got, greg.com with a three uh, for the E in Greg. And uh, if I go over here to email, uh, I can see that it says, okay, get started with email routing. What I can do in this case is, um, here's the way that the email routing works. Uh, what happens is I can set up a domain specific email address like greg at greg.com. Uh, in, in this example, and that email address will be perfectly functional to receive email. However, it won't be functional for sending email from that address, and that's the big difference. You can receive email with a forwarded email address, and what happens is that email that comes in gets forwarded to my own personal address or a different business address that's not visible to the public or, or whatever address I want. And oftentimes I've used this for clients that don't want to have an additional email address to check or set up in their systems. They just want everything to come in to their Gmail account, but they don't necessarily want to set up, uh, you know, email hosting. Um, and they do want an email address at their business name.com. And so let me share my screen again and um, I'll show you how to complete and set this up. So you need to add these DNS records to your DNS settings here under Cloudflare. And all I need to do right here is click add records and enable. And that just adds the DNS records. If I double check, I can go over here and click DNS. And you can see that these four, three MX records and one text record, which is SPF for protection from spam and spoofing and such is added automatically for me. So now I can go to email and uh, you do have to create a destination address that has been verified. All you do is add the destination address and it sends you an email to verify and you click to verify that address that it exists. And so this is my overview. If I just go to routes, I can go ahead and um, add, create an address right here. And then I add it to any of my verified addresses like greg at leveragewp.com. So I could say, I could even say that it's gd at greg.com, anything very, very small. You know, if I, so if I want to do greg at greg with a three dot com, or even if I was using this as a business email, oftentimes I use the word info at uh, greg.com or whatever the business name is. The action, I want to send that email to an email. You can send it to somewhere else and do things within Cloudflare, like adding it to a worker in Cloudflare. That's a topic for a different video. But I usually will set up, send to an email, and choose the destination email that I've previously set up. Then I would click save, and I'm done. Now I have a working email at a custom domain name, and I didn't have to sign up for hosted email, pay any money for this, uh, or ask the client to set up a, uh, you know, a, a uh, an email address inside of their Mac mail or their Outlook or anything like that to have hosted email. It's very powerful to set up easy custom domain business email for clients or for your own business. So I hope that was helpful. Thanks, Leverage WP. See you next time.